adults at the time would repeat things over and over again. For instance, uh, Newsweek magazine. My dad used to get it all the time. And we'd be sitting around the dinner table, and he'd say, well, you know, and then he'd say word for word a sentence uh, that was read from the Newsweek magazine. So it was like the magazine programmed him to say that thing. This wasn't an original thought that he had. And that's really where it started, I guess. You know, in my, like, early childhood, the concept that the people that I was dealing with were, I used the term uh, chemical robots at the time, but the, but the concept that they, they weren't actually conscious. They had these repeated behaviors that they would do over and over again. In his paper, Nick Bostrom defined a simulation of the entire mental history of mankind as an ancestor simulation when estimating the amount of computing power one might need. 